mic on. There we go. Now my mic is working. Now it's actually doing the screen thing. Okay, that took way too fucking long. Okay, here's what we're doing. A quick artificer run because somebody asked for it. And when somebody asks for a run, I do a run. Alrighty. You do your thing. This will actually work well on you because turret damage counts as your damage. Okay, we are going... Yeah, we're going this way. Now, the number one most important thing for an artificer is haste. So we've got a couple of options with that. Normally, I would want to go with protagonist, but I've been having a bit of a falling out with them recently, so don't like them as much. And then as for other options, there's Yokai, which could be fun. So we'll do that. The monkeys should prove a good distraction. As for healing, we should get enough from uh, the point. And also, yeah, these guys do get affected by the AoE uh, intelligence boost. I'm not sure what the hell Harrison was high on. I think here I particularly want... Sir. Well, I'm out of money. No, I'm not. So we'll get you and we'll get a bard. Now then. Sorry, I need to prove somebody wrong about something exceedingly fast. <sighs> because they're just being wrong. I cannot allow people to be wrong. There we go. Do. And if you open that image in your browser, you can clearly see that they're under the effect of the buff. <sighs> Why must I provide proof from teeny tiny screenshots that people cannot see with their own eyes? Sure, I'll kidnap you for now. We'll sell you later. Once we get a bard. Now you all own this corner and you plague anybody who gets near. We go up here, we heal all of you. And then you suit the crap out of people. With your buffs. Barely had to even be in the neighborhood. This isn't a permadeath run, so I'm not too worried about things. The 
poison does kind of suck. And he's here. I thought he would have been able to take one of those. Turns out I was wrong. Please kill that man. Thank you. We run over here and we get you guys your uh, armor back. And we cap the point. Oh, hi, my dude. How are you feckin' doing, bro? And we run. We run so far away. And uh, some people have to die for the greater good, which is unfortunate, but, uh, oh well. Punch that man. Yes! Stab him. He's being a butthead to me. Punch them. Yee. Punch them in their stupid, silly faces. I'm not entirely sure what's killing them at range, but uh, I... Oh, it's my one damage uh, projectile thing that comes back like every three seconds. Shoot them. This plague makes us that these guys cannot cloak, which makes them basically neutered. As long as I'm standing here acting as Supreme Guardian, they shall die. Cease. Hooray. Uh, yeah, this is fine. Sure, take that too. And you take that. This one kind of sucked. Yeah, yeah, it was on back. So. I suppose I can do this and have it work out, but yeah. Extra health on the entire party is crucially important. Uh, that'll help you out a bunch. And... Sure. Ridiculously stupid enough to work. And somebody died immediately to random arrows. That's the one thing that I really hate about this update, is that it feels like random arrows from fucking nobodies, which before would deal like one damage, and now are enough to kill people. Which is insanely annoying, because before, I didn't have to care about them. Now I do. Let's punch him, please. Punch him, Jesus. Yeah, this is far from the, uh, you know, army of turrets that I had envisioned. It's not like I can stand still for half a fucking second. When I'm being hunted down by five billion arrows. Hit him! Nice. Alrighty, and bard time. Woo, bard time. Alrighty. Get over here. That goes most certainly to you. That goes most certainly to you. That can go to you. That can go to you. That can go to you. And magically everything is fine now. 
as we put you back up front in your rightful place. Uh, it's, oh, yeah. And, uh, we'll swap those, I suppose. That is actually pretty important. We'll buy that. We'll sell that for sure. We'll buy that. Well, no, we'll just move that over. Uh, yeah. We'll do that and that. That way you're now max level and do all your healing stoofs. And everything should be good on that front. And I'd like to use you, but I don't think I can. We aren't using any Russer units, nor that, nor that. So, take these give you the HP and kind of split it out between the two of you when it comes to that we definitely give it to you any reply from the McFulios uh, For this, we'll go... I guess we'll go up through here, around here, and uh, all the fun things. Actually, we can go from here straight to there, so yeah. We'll just have to fight uh, Elite Knight, which shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, the main issue here is that the enemies aren't stunned, nor are they slowed, so we really aren't having a chance to, you know, stand still against them. And we aren't tanky enough to just stand there yet. Spreading some fun knowledge. annoying but manageable now please chuck a potion and kill a man thank you no matter where you run you're getting shot for immense amounts of damage nice don't think that's gonna help do that because I want to sell this and get you some HP and all the turrets died in like 0.25 seconds yeah, I don't think they got any kind of HP buff to deal with the, you know, massive amounts of damage that are, you know, now pretty commonplace. They deal lots of damage, but they also take a ton. Jesus. Uh. 
where is the group strategist bonus going? Or, oh, it's this, that's, okay. But that is not half. That is plus four. So the party-wide haste bonus is I think I got it in time for that. Hold on, let me check. Hmm, I have to press the buttons very fast in a very specific order in order to make that happen. So did I get it? No. Oh well. Anyways, bug. Bug report. Uh, okay. Uh, This is why I do random challenges that people tell me to, because you never know when stuff like this is going to get found. So these guys work really well with rangers, with slows, with a bunch of other things, but trying to put them all by themselves, they aren't going to do too great, especially because that damage is going to fall off. That is very good. I will go ahead and sell this, buy this, and put that on you. Nice. Sir. Fifty-five, that's fine then. You need it. And, sir, probably you as well. Now we need to get you some int, that way you can actually heal some people, and uh, a lot more haste. Now Plague is just never going to die. Wonderful. It's my preferred type of guy. Not dead. And you guys will just level up by fighting things. That is beautiful. 100% take that. And now just hit him a bunch of times with a hammer. Make sure he doesn't suit them. Alrighty, come on, Grandpa. We're taking you to the old people's home. Get back here. We got an escaping Grandpa. Yeah, they should be able to do fine. I 
they supposed to, you know... Okay, they are supposed to stun people. I was worried I had a loose wrench somewhere. Uh, yeah. That'll do. Is it exceedingly dangerous? Oh, yes. Do I care? No. Whoa! Mm -hmm. Please throw a bomb. Yes! Nuke them! Okay, thank Jebsus. Okay, well, he's down there doing, you know, his thing. Uh, we just stand up here and we build like 50 turrets. Thanks to the bard, we can get that done pretty fast. So nuke all of those people and then that's gonna hurt. Yes, walk down here. This is totally safe. Heh, it was not safe. They got wrecked. That is very, very good. As now, maybe people will actually be, you know, under the effect of the buff most of the time. I really haven't been concerned about my uh, character's HP since I got the Goodwind Boots. So the Goodwind Boots are unfortunately doing their job very well. I say unfortunately because I don't like the Goodwind Boots. But I cannot deny that in this case they are pretty good. The fact that this is our AoE for against the boss fight though is... <sighs> Worrying. So we'll sell this and we'll get more than enough to purchase this, but we don't need it because, well, reasons. Yeah, we'll go ahead and buff you for more stuff. We'll give you that for now. We don't really need you to have that. We can give you that and we can sell that. And on to the next thing. Which, that was apparently the last combat we're going to do. Wonderful. Uh, so we don't need that if that was going to be our last combat. So I'll just buy this. And give all the haste in the world to... One to you and then one to each of you. I'm a communist. What can I say? That is a joke, YouTube. That is a joke. That is a joke. That is a joke. I thought that would actually give me someone's wallet. Because that is a thing that can happen. But nope. Wait, well then. It's like poetry it rhymes. And burning plate, which I will sell immediately because it is bad. Very bad. That's a very good item, unfortunately. Uh, no. I can't put you next to him because you have such low HP, it would go terribly. No, and I guess we'll just sell these then. Okay, you get some more HP on you. Your skin and bones, boy. Uh, extra haste, sir. Extra haste, sir. Extra HP and haste, sir. You've been a good boy. You deserve it. Give me some of those. Alright. 
Let's go, alrighty. How in the hell is this gonna go? Build up a good little nest of turrets, and then we're gonna walk over here, leave them alone for a bit, but try and persuade some people to walk this way, buff them up. Walk back over this way, put down more turrets. Now, really, it depends on where the heck the boss is gonna spawn. That is going to determine who wins. Okay, spawned there, that's not great, but mm, some of them lived. Now, he is not, you know, only half as effective on bosses for uh, the turret slow, which I think is like the only thing in the game that's not half as effective on bosses. And we really don't got to worry about the poison damage because we have an alchemist and they are bonkers. Alrighty, one man down because I was a fool. That's all right, that's all right. We still have an unkillable front line and the back line has the five HP, but you know. So the moment the dogs come out, the bard is going to need to be up against a wall. No, not in a good way. Wallbard survived. I think he's unkillable. Which would be a very nice change of pace. Oh yeah, getting them to punch each other in the face is also a pretty good way of making them not alive. This may be the slowest win in history, but it'll be a win. Oh, it'll be a win. Watch out, yep. Saw that coming. Absolutely unkillable Giga Chad. Frontline tank healer. Friendship ended with Paladin. Plague Doctor is my friend now. Alright, we still have plague. Plague is all we need. 
one good doctor versus the world. I mean, what? Isn't this supposed to be dealing a hundred damage? Instead, it ends up dealing like 20 or something. Yeah, he's surrounded on all sides by dogs and still doing completely fine. I believe I should open a petition called uh, Nerf Plague. I, I might have even said somewhere, I think Plague is a bit strong at the moment. I said this earlier, but this, this would be why, devs. He does not care. Or maybe this is the power of Goodwind Boots giving seven armor to any unit in the game for free. Well, not for free. It's a very expensive item. But the point stands. And this isn't even with the int bonus that you gain from going up here and doing the capture point. That is just how strong the man is. I do a Plague Doctor only run, but uh, that'd just be King only with less steps. Yeah, I did move him so that the king would take more of the hits. I don't care. King has, like, an extra 40 HP and an extra 2 armor. He should be taking these hits. It's not because he got the buff. There we go. Eventually, this man will die. And... Okay, I thought that was going to be the death of my artificer, but nope. <sighs> I would like the world to recognize that my Plague Doctor took 8,866 damage. End of story.